Welcome to the Beneficiary Management Tutorial. In this video, I will show you the steps to create one beneficiary, upload a list of beneficiary, and view the list of created beneficiaries. After successful login to Wasil Connect, you can create one beneficiary by clicking on the Beneficiary tab on the left side menu, then click on Create Beneficiary subtab you will be navigated to the Create Beneficiary page. Enter the Patient National ID or Iqama ID in the Patient Details field, then click on the Inquire CCHI button. The patient details will be imported from CCHI, like patient name, gender, document type, document ID, and insurance plans details. You only need to enter the patient's date of birth, and then, in the Insurance Plan section, click on Set Primary option which shows the patient's insurance company. Finally, click on Add Beneficiary button to save this beneficiary into the system. To upload a list of one or more beneficiaries, go to the Beneficiary tab on the left side menu then click on Upload Beneficiaries subtab. You will be navigated to the Upload Beneficiary page. Go to the Download Sample button on the upper right side of the page to download the Excel template which you need to use to upload your beneficiaries data. You need to upload up to 5,000 beneficiaries in each Excel file upload. In the Excel file, you need to fill out the patient's full name, document type, and document ID, which represents either national ID or Iqama ID, gender, and date of birth. After filling the Excel file, you can drag it to the upload page or you can click on the upload icon to select it from your file system to be uploaded to a Seal Connect portal. To edit beneficiary, go to the Beneficiary tab on the left side menu and click on Beneficiary List subtab. You will be navigated to the Beneficiary page where you can search for a patient by any of these options. Name, Document ID, Contact Number, File ID, or member card ID. Click on the desired patient you would like to edit from the search results list and you will be navigated to the patient's personal information. Here, you will be allowed to edit the patient information by clicking on Edit and then you can click Save. Thank you for watching.